Hello. Oh, praise God. It's 6 9 in the morning on Sunday, October the 22nd, 2017. It's going to be a beautiful day today, a glorious day after days of rain. The Lord's been really great to me. He's given me a car. He's given me a home. I've got no rural debts. And I can travel all over Australia and all around a place preaching no to same-sex marriage. Well, just as I want to say again, I saw in the news last night they had no same-sex marriage while in Sydney. If I'd only known about that and the advertising wasn't pulled, I would have been down there like a shot to join in. So I want to say to the people who run that rally, I'm totally 100% behind them. Because I know same-sex marriage is very, very evil, very wrong, and very oppressive. And I'll fight these people online and on in social media to the day I die. We don't need same-sex marriage. Marriage is traditional between one man and one woman, not of the same bloodline and of the age of consent. In other words, of the age of 18, if you're going to get literally married, because that's when you have the right to sign your name. I know marriage has come a little bit younger in years gone by, past. That's okay, as long as they're of a mature age. I'll repeat that again. One man to one woman not of the same bloodline, over the age of consent. Only. Two men, no, no. Two women, no, no. Because two men become three men, and one woman, and becomes a, a blinking mess. It is politics. It is nothing to do with love at all. Excuse me saying this, I don't like using this rough language. That's all bullshit and bull crap put by the homosexual lobby and propaganda in a Joseph Goebbels style in your window to push a political agenda. That's all same-sex marriage is, to push a political agenda, a left-wing cultural Marxist agenda. It's politics. Nothing to do with love. Forget the issues about love because love doesn't even come in. I am a victim of it. Other people can be victims and be many, many, many more victims if it gets passed. This is not a victimised, victimless sin. This is a wicked piece of wicked piece of legislation and if it goes through, wickedness will come into Australia and there'll be lots of victims in the churches. We need to stop it before it even gets off the ground. So that's my final message I'll put over this issue at the moment. I back that rally in Sydney, the no same-sex rally, 100%, and I tell everyone in Australia, we must back the no same-sex marriage campaign. We do not need to change our legislation. We do not need our laws changed because of a bunch of homosexual people wanting to get married or as other people will say put in brackets a bunch of poofs wanting to marry one another to mess up society that's all it is and that's all of our state thank you very much and bye for now